Welcome to Soft Reviewed. Ideogram launched its newest version and it has got a lot of new features. As you can see, now you can create images uh, using their realistic model, 3D anime. Here you can select any styles and you can also uh, use the color palette that you want if uh, branding is important for you then this is like a major update you can even choose your custom colors so if you are in the paid plan but for free users you have the option to select all these color combinations so if you are not sure about which uh, color to choose you can keep it as auto and those are the options that's available in the free version now i think it's good option uh, with the, all these new features uh, let's take a look at their new uh, as you can see the quality has improved and you can also change the color palette like that and you can switch between different styles as well wow. yeah so it uh, has got a mobile app as well and the api is also now available for all users the api pricing is different so you will have a separate pricing plan for the api that's the ad that they have so now let me let me just create a prompt for it i'll make the thumbnail for this video mediagram api and version to launch is it any good that will be the text let me just run uh, with different models it's running on sonnet gemini and llama 3.1 so let's see which one uh, comes up with the best prompt here i usually choose the sonnet one uh, let me see my going api okay i will go with this one a cartoon scientist juggling ideogram logo and the version to text speech bubble mind-blowing api background okay uh, let's see what this can generate let's keep this auto and gen generate now the generation can be previewed so that's a new change mind blowing api okay The text is good, but let's look at some of the generations here. Look at the quality of these images. These are the realistic image that it generated. Not bad. These are some of the designs that it can generate. It's good at generating designs. Let's look at some of the 3D images that it generated. Okay. Anime. Yeah, as you can see, uh, these are some of the images that I generated now. can see the text quality there are spelling mistakes every now and then but yeah it improved a bit one thing to also note is that it will use two credits that means you will only get five generation per day earlier it was like 10 generation that's one downside of using the new model let's see if this is any good these are the different Images that it generated. Beautiful woman scientist in the airport. Text API breakthrough and soft reviewed subtly woven into her lab coat fabric. It's not woven into her fabric. Here it's there. And here it's also there, but the text is not that visible. So, yeah, uh, still there is a lot to improve, but when you compare it with the previous model, I can see that there is improvement slight improvement this is actually the one that properly adhered to my prompt but still 
there is this text that i don't i'm gonna skip this I want to show you guys what it can generate and if we also have the option to switch to the version one if we if we only want to use the one credit system now this was the prompt that they generated for me and i was able to generate all these for the thumbnail so that text adherence is good with the new version there is no spelling mistakes i think i will go with this one or this one yeah i think i will go with this one yeah and gemini pro gave me the correct one for this one always the best i usually get the best prompts with the cloud or gemini try that out when you create your image prompts uh, that's a small tip now let's click on this burger icon and click on this button where we can now sign up for the api so it will ask for a payment you need to choose whether it's personal or business then it will take you to the stripe where you can make connect your account and it will be charged as per your usage so if you go to the api documentation and api pricing we can see the pricing here so the newest version 2.0 or text to image will take 0 0.08 cents for one image there is also a turbo version which is fast and bit cheap which comes at uh, 0.5 and these are the older versions and there is also an upscaler that you can use if you want to upscale the image which will cost around points that's the pricing uh, and this is the api documentation uh, you can go through and connect it to your favorite automation platform uh, let me know in the comments if you want to see me integrating this with make.com if any of you are interested i will create that video for you so that's it uh, i hope uh, this was helpful uh, do check this out uh, it's interesting have more uh, features customizable color palettes and the api are the actual new changes i hope this was informational if you liked it please don't forget to share and subscribe for more future videos again thank you for watching have a great day